I first read the treatment, and the treatment was brilliant. Um, not only was it presented to me in, uh, I, I saw the whole treatment, it, it, it was, the, Paco used the graphics of the Franco era, and I love, I love black and white photography, and he explained everything that was going to happen, and it was kind of the most comprehensive treatment. And then I read the script. It's amazing. And then I read the script. I, don't, I didn't get all of the scripts right away. They, they were coming one by one. And I was devouring them and going like, oh my god. And I just wanted to turn the page, like, what's going to happen next? A mí me encantó. A mí llegaron más tarde, yo llegué más tarde. Y me llegaron los ochos de tirón. Y los, los leí en un día, bueno, un día, en una, un par de horas. Y me, me encantó. Flipé. Digo, qué guay, que Paco me llamaba eso, eso, la hostia. Um, well, I, I, I wasn't too worried about portraying Ava Gardner, because there's only one Ava Gardner. But I tried to embody her espíritu, her spirit, her sexualidad, her, her passion for life, um, and to humanize her. Um, her, you know, portraying her, obviously, I, I don't physically look like her, and, I, and it makes me nervous to be criticized by mean people. <laughs> But at the end of the day, I don't care. My job is to tell a story. And um, I, I was honored, because she was quite an amazing woman. And the, for me, that Paco cast me and, and said, you sound Puerto Rican. She didn't go to Puerto Rico. She came to Madrid. So I had to, for me as an actress, it was very fulfilling to go to school to learn you know, how to say habitación and to, you know, to, to learn castellano. It was really a, a challenge for me and I had so much fun. Pues, fue muy fácil, la verdad. No voy a mentir. Eh, sobre todo por ella, ¿no? Cuando alguien te da tanto y alguien tiene esa energía que para mí es mucho más es fácil contestar porque la verdad, como, como actor y como el personaje, eh, respondo a ella. Entonces, si ella está, anda, anda ¿qué? Yo, eh, yo, yo respondo, pero si tiene que trabajar, que tú no puedes estar todo, todos los días de marcha, de fiesta, que tiene que responder. Entonces, cuanto más me da ella, más fácil responder. Y la verdad, ella es fenomenal, es una crack. Crack, I like that. <laughs> well, for, for me, I had to stick to the script. Uh, as it was because I had to learn Spanish. And I did uh, 80%, 80, yeah, 80, 80% in Castilian. So for me, um, that, it, it didn't stop my freedom because Paco makes your performance bigger. He brings everything out of you. And then after we've gotten this, the scene the way they want it, then he would let you go off script as much as you wanted. Really, um, and we, he's he's just so open all the time. He tries new things all the time. También quiero decir algo de Ana. Ana también eh, a mí me encanta trabajar con ella porque y, y es un placer trabajar tener dos porque te sientes sí. muy arropado eh, porque mmm, Paco sí que con las posturas y <laughs> te enseña y la verdad pa Paco lo tiene claro en la cabeza y actúa todo pero tener Ana al lado también eh, que de vez en cuando dice pero Paco por qué no intentamos así mm -hmm. por qué no eh, a mí me gusta que diga las frases no sé qué. entonces también eh, como codirección nos sentimos muy arropados y, y me encantó trabajar con los dos <laughs>